Okay. All right, gang. So yeah, my Facebook live attempt failed miserably because I can't get both me and Braddock on the call at the same time. So <laughs> hey, Braddock, how's it going? It's going pretty good over here. How are things in Arizona? Hot. Oh, really? Hot. <laughs> All right, so before we get started, I just want to remind you guys, Masterclass is coming up September 14th and 15th. FloorZap is sponsoring it, so Braddock's going to be there. He can go over all your questions then, or you can call him anytime, really, to get a demo. Um, so the Masterclass is great for those of you that want to grow your sales and work fewer hours. Um, it's funny, I was talking to a flooring dealer yesterday, and uh, he explained to me how he went to a master class like two years ago and implemented only like 5% of what he learned. And it's just made a dramatic difference in his business. So he wants to continue on with that and sign up for the next class. But uh, what a lot of us deal with too, is his father was working for them, started the store, worked for years. He's second generation and uh, trying to get out of the ways that the father was doing it. Um, and the prices that the parents were charging, you know, that's always a challenge for the younger people that are trying to take over the business and want to adapt to a lot of these new ways that we have, such as Floors App, you know, creating a business system that's going to help you. Uh, the master class is just $397, and that's if you want to come live, join us in Florida, or if you want to join us online. Either way, September 14th and 15th. So there's no extra charge to bring a spouse or a business partner. And the hotel's available now to get signed up. We got special rates on that as well. All right, so today I got Braddock from Floors App and he's gonna share the benefits of the Pride and Proof. We're not going over the full uh, Floors App operating system. Uh, we're just gonna focus on this feature. I, I, I keep wanting to call it a new feature, but how long has it been uh, that you guys have had this the installer portal hasn't been changed for maybe two or three years. So, um, okay, so that's been around for a couple of years, but this program is gonna help overall uh, for the installers to have more pride in their job. And one of the things that you, know, you see in surveys that what installers want most is, is more pay. And something I've always argued is the, the two things installers want is to be kept busy and to have all their stuff on the job. Um, but the one thing I find that has the greatest effect on installers is when they're a part of your company and they take pride in the work and the five-star reviews are reflecting it. And it, they're just a part of the process of this growing company and, and a very important part. Um, so they take pride in the business and the work that they do and as they should. You know, there's a, the work is incredibly complicated, so they should be taking pride in it. Um, so tell us a little bit about how this program works. Okay, so our program usually works from the installer portal. Okay, so the contractors have their own login to the system, which doesn't count against your user account. It's free. We want people to use it. We think it's a big part of our system. Okay. And so through that installer portal, they have a bunch of different options that they can do on the job. I'm going to tell you, it's going to be relatively simple. Okay. It's not going to be complicated because we know that installers aren't the most technical people in the world. Okay. So all they have to do is find the job on the schedule. It highlights today and they can click on that job. Okay. The, the things that we're going to highlight today is, you know, of course they can see their work order and stuff through that. But really what we're talking about is the ability for before pictures, the ability for after pictures, the ability to mark the job is done and the completion certificate. So the before pictures are obviously huge because these tell you what what did it look like before? I can't tell you how many times, you know, we have clients and, and you you I know you guys out there watching have experienced it yourself where a client tries to claim damage that wasn't your guys's. OK. And I've had this happen all the time, but if you have well-documented before pictures that show the floor and the damage before, especially if it's in the floor, but also appliances in the area you're working in. I had a client that, you know, someone had damaged their fridge and they tried to claim that it was the installers, but they had the before pictures that clearly showed the old floor 
with the damaged fridge. And then all of a sudden they never heard from that client again that said they were, you know, that they needed, they demanded a new fridge. And also they never heard from them again. And unfortunately there are people like that out there. So in order to protect yourself, I think the, the biggest thing that you can have your installers do is when they get to the site, take pictures of the job site, and then especially take, you know, more detailed pictures of any damages they see in, in those working areas. Well, when they're doing that too, they're inspecting the job, they're inspecting the project, they're familiarizing themselves, and they probably got a question, you know, just one about maybe a transition or something else that, boom, here's a photo, it's in the customer's file. Answer my question about this. Yeah. Right, exactly. And so you're going to get questions a lot, you know, in the job, and hopefully you're getting less questions. And that's, you know, why you have your comments and your notes and your installer work order that they can pull up and hopefully you know, or most of the time our clients tell you that it does lessen the questions. It did for me when I worked at the store, right? Uh, you get a lot less questions, but there's still going to be questions. It's not going to eliminate everything with an installer. I mean, oh, but that's a great that point because it trains that salesperson on some of the stuff that they need to look out for that if they don't get this feedback and information, you know, and we went over that arguments back and forth between dealers and installers where the the installers assume the dealers are knowledgeable about something that they probably aren't and don't understand the complexity of some of the install it's just going to be magically done by the installer elves and <laughs> so the, that communication is gold that really helps both everybody right and and also in, in those before pictures that they can view it on their side so if the salesman takes a picture of anything that they want the installer to take, you know, special care and they can, the installer can also see that in the, in their profile there. So the, even, even the salesman could take pictures like, Hey, you told me about this last time, this transition kind of looks like the other transition that you told me was an issue. Like, what do you want to do here? It might be extra cost. I understand this, you know, um, just, and just having that breakdown, uh, to, to do it, uh, would be great. Yeah. So, um, and then when the job is done afterwards, let's talk about that. They're going okay. to take photos of, of that, that project. And yeah. So when the job is done also after pictures. Okay. And I am a huge, huge believer in this, um, spiffing installers that take great photos because one taking a the difference between taking a photo and taking a good or great photo is probably about five to six extra seconds of effort, right? Looking at a lighting, maybe opening a blind, coming from a different angle slightly. And if you, and you, and you talk about this and you preach it and I, and I preach it the same, you know, and I'm a huge believer in it myself, is if you spiff out these installers or give them a little extra on top for taking good pictures, because if you get them, they're automatically uploaded into your floors app file. You can look at it, and from there, it's a pretty easy drag and drop to send to your website team. Or if you're, you know, using one of our websites, also, you know, you can just send it right over to us. Or hey, take it out of this job for us. They, they took really good pictures, and we'll just put it right onto your website into your gallery. I mean, that's really, really awesome. Okay? Right, your website, your social media, you mm -hmm. can use it on your sales calls. So when you're working with other customers to have those portfolio photos is invaluable. Right. Instagram now, you know, TikTok videos, <laughs> you can use them everywhere. Right. And, and, and they do so much better than stock photos. One thing we haven't even talked you. about, what happens three years down the road, four or five years when there's warranty issues or, or something comes up, installer makes it or a customer makes a claim and, and you've got their photos on file. I mean, I, not to dismiss their claim, but it's just, it elevates your customer service to a degree that nobody can compete with you in that, in your area. Right, exactly. And, um, and, and just having that and, and getting those five-star reviews are so important to Google. It helps rank your website. It helps build customer trust. It helps, you know, just the branding of it is, is so useful to do that. And so having those after pictures help a lot. Oh, also, and here's the other thing. You give an after picture, you give the photos to the customer. Hey, thanks for your project. One, it makes it easier to get paid from the customer. Two, if they use those photos on Google, it makes that review so much more powerful. Uh, and also Yelp. I mean, if they're using Yelp, 
that's huge to have yeah. those photos and a description of the photos I, that makes your reviews just again nobody can compete with you in in your area yeah a hundred percent a hundred percent yeah and then you know when installer a knowing the installer's done is nice because they can mark it as done and you get an alert in your system to know that installer's done and you can go check out these things the last thing i want to talk about is the completion certificate okay and so this can be either on the installer's portal or it can be sent by you guys manually or sent by the installer by email or sms okay email or text doesn't matter but when you're sending to the client you're giving the client that opportunity to walk through a job and see how it looks and make sure it looks right to them and then signing off that they're done because that's going to give them greater confidence like hey you go look at the job and when you think it's you think everything's right with it then you give us a signature here right Perfect. and it's just that extra step where if they come back and they come back later oh that damage was there then why did you sign the completion certificate you were supposed to check this out now that doesn't mean you don't do it right <laughs> doesn't mean you just you know uh ignore that that claim that's happening there but at least it gives them that sense like you know this is we're waiting on for you to sign this completion certificate for you for for you so you know we know we're done because you've approved that we're done so I know it, it, that you can send the, the final invoice to the customer and I, I, they can, from their phone, click the pay button mm -hmm. and pay it. So super convenient. Uh, do the installers ever do that? Have the customer just pay right from the app? Yeah, so the installer can do that. So on the completion certificate, you have an option, turn it on and off, of collecting the balance payment. Um, a lot of, you know, a lot of people do it where the installer collects the balance payment. Now, other yeah, people why wouldn't you? I, and I, and a lot of us are uncomfortable having the installer deal with that. We don't want them mm -hmm. taking credit card information. We don't want them uh, taking a check or even having to ask for it. A lot of us won't make our installers do that. Mm -hmm. But shoot, if it's on the phone, it's on the app, click pay and bam, you're done. And that's right. not a, and so they're not it. really handling the customer's information they're no. just using the installer's tablet or phone to, to fill out the invoice that's on there and yeah. then of course like i said earlier even the installer can send it or you guys can send it from your back office if you don't want your installer doing with it or you can just turn off payments completely and just have the installer get the customer to sign off and then send the invoice separately we have clients do it all three ways it just depends on what and what works for you guys if you have your own in-house installers that you trust might as well get them to sign and pay right on the spot. If you have guys that you've never seen before and you know that you came off recommendation, you haven't used them and you're a little, ah, I don't know, then you know that's when you're gonna just, hey, get them to sign off, we'll send the invoice later, okay? Um, so, I mean, and you have that ability to turn it off and on per job. So that way, that way, you know, in one job I'm going to get them to sign and collect and another job I'm not, just because of, you know, how comfortable you are. All right, so, I'm going to run. Do we have anything else on the on the program? I mean, it's pretty. There's a, just no, a that, lot that, of stuff. That's pretty much the basic. I mean, we can dive into the weeds all day, right? But oh, yeah, no, that's I don't want to do that. Basics. OK, so um, here's the program. It's twenty five hundred dollars for onboarding floors app. And um, we didn't even begin to touch all the stuff it'll do for your business. Um, but the uh, some of the additional things are the showroom pricing, which is huge help you track and, and keep track that and their price is stupid low as it is it's 750 which is a one-time fee pipeline profit is a good marketing program that they've implemented for you uh to keep track of your database and, and email marketing to them that's just 150 a month and then the installer pride and proof program is only a hundred dollars a month extra uh and then right now what they're doing is you'd save a thousand dollars off that twenty five hundred dollar price and so it's just $1,500 now to sign up. And then your showroom pricing, uh, pipeline profit and installer pride and proof program, uh, that's for you at no extra charge. Um, this is what they're doing, uh, sponsoring the masterclass. So some specials that they wanna extend to you guys. So you get up to three members is only 269 a month, uh, five members, 399 and 10 members is 699 and you save a month of that fee if you pay annually. Mm -hmm. So, and then the the big thing with this 
uh, that I love is a 90 day money back guarantee. So if for any reason you guys don't like it or it's not working for you, one of the reasons they're doing this is because nobody's ever canceled the program. So <laughs> they, well, we've had offering. one, but we've had one. So you have one. No, <laughs> somebody that wasn't using it. Right. <laughs> and, and that's the reason that people will cancel it is, is they just don't get around to using it. The only thing that we ask you to do is enter every lead, you know, just those leads are valuable. So enter them and get in the habit of using it. Make sure your employees are entering them. It's not an option if they feel like it. No, enter the damn lead. <laughs> so, and, uh, um, but no, if it's not working out for you, fair enough. They'll give you a 90 day money back guarantee. Um, nobody's offering that, that has any kind of software system. And I don't even like calling this software. I like calling it, it's a business operating system because if you follow the process, it's going to take your business from point of sale from, from the phone call where they're uh, wanting to hire you all the way down to the final sale, picking up the check. Or if people don't go with you, it gives you the follow-up to keep asking them, hey, are you ready to do this project now? So, so many ways that this is going to help just catapult your business. Um, and I used to tell people that are new in business, you know, no, don't worry about this kind of thing. I, I mean, that's for down the road as you grow. And the reason I would tell people that is because the programs are 10 grand that are out there, you know, so no, you don't invest $10,000 in a program when you're brand new. This 1500 bucks, hell yeah, you need to invest in this because it's, super easy to use, cloud-based, and they'll get you trained in less than six weeks. Some of you that are really aggressive uh, in less than two weeks. So you can train yourself on it. It's so easy to use. But anything else? No, not today, Jerry. All right. So if they want to get a hold of you, uh, Braddock at floorsapp.com. We'll put it yep. in the post. And uh you guys have a great profitable week. And if you want to sign up for the masterclass, reach out to me as well. Let's get you signed up for that. Yeah, All right. We'll include the landing page as well on the, well, in the post. Okay, perfect. All right, guys, we'll talk to you later. All right. Sounds good.